I am Florella Perkins Ames. I am 102 years old, and I live in Waterbury Center, Vermont. My parents' names were Arthur and Ida Perkins. When uh, my mother was a little girl, she, her, her, her grandma, grandfather uh, used to play the fiddle for country dances in homes. In fact, in this house where I am right now, they used to dance squares upstairs, 1890, around that time. And then in my lifetime, uh, here at Waterbury Center, uh, we had uh, dances, lots of dances and we had an orchestra from uh, Middlesex and their chief, uh, uh, I, I don't know what I want to say, the thing that people used to go to the dances for, his name was Crazy Chase, he played the f fiddle and he was a show in himself. Uh, he had a big head of wavy hair, dark hair, and he just put a show on while he was playing the violin. He was extremely good. My dad used to call square dances, contra dances, Virginia Reel, Portland Fancy, Lady of the Lake, and such. And we used to have uh, what they call promenades occasionally. That was no dancing, it was just marching to sort of band music. That was a lot of fun. This would have been uh, when I was, oh, in my early teens, very early teens. It was always uh, a hustle to do the chores, you know, the milking, eat our supper, get ready to go. Yes, everybody in town came. It was a community affair. It was a way of life, I guess, for me at that time. We didn't have only the country music, we had the dances, waltz, waltzes, foxtrot. During that time, the Harvard Hop came in. Wow. I've never even heard of the Harvard you Hop. You never heard of the Harvard Hop? No. Would you like to learn it? I think I would, and if it ever came, came back again, I would be all set. Mm -hmm. In Burlington, Vermont, on almost every weekend, there's a contra dance. I'm not surprised. What's more fun than dancing? <laughs> <laughs>